but geomaxing i mean it's i think it's kind of a meme though it's kind of like a lot of like the critics of it would say that it's like you know like yellow fever or whatever but i, I think it is i mean it may be a meme because i think like you know look at the targets okay like here's the reality is that a lot of like men think that Asian women or Slavic women are like more demure and feminine and subvert subservient. That's not the case. That's not always no. the case. A yeah. lot of, a lot of Asian women, they just have like, especially Vietnamese women or like Filipinas, they just have this weird like mind control over you. Um, <laughs> I know I've, 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 in Canada, I've seen this with my own eyes with guys like older boomers that get married to like Filipino women. Um, I will, I will say know. that East Asian women uh, they are more feminine on average. They're more feminine, yeah. Definitely. They were not more. They're definitely not more submissive and subservient. Though. Yeah, they, no. but they are. Definitely oh, and Slavic women, feminine. forget about it. Like they'll literally like tear your heart. Like literally, like I'm like literally tear your heart out and and sell it in an organ harvesting operation. Yeah, if um, you're <laughs> if you're not gonna if you're not you know successful with women in your own country, uh, it's not going to get any easier for you going abroad. I mean, like the the women themselves might be different, you know, to some degree with you know uh, looks or uh, you know femininity or what have you. But at the end of the day, they're still women, and basically they all respond to the same things. It know? does drive white women crazy, though. Like there, yeah, there is, was that uh, one. That's, that's my favorite part about it. <laughs> there was that one. <laughs> that was that one. I think it was. Um, I forget who it was. It may have been uh, Cozy Griper, or it may have been. Um, atrazine griper that said that if america only let in immigration for hot like latinas and asian women then white women would form ss units overnight yeah <laughs> they have a few different would. variations on that on that one the one for europe was that if they only let in uh sort of eastern european blondes or like meaner baddies from the middle east <laughs> like, yeah yeah like, yeah the, the european women would form ss death squads which right. is true you, you know, know my it's... good friend uh, Gonzalo Lira. I know people like in the manosphere are very divided on him, but uh, mm. my good friend Gonzalo Lira, he uh, had this video where he red pilled people on uh, Slavic women. He's like, if you don't have experience, bro, like you're not going to make it with Slavic women. So uh, yeah, maybe Ukrainians, maybe uh, maybe other forms of Slavic, maybe Romanians, but uh, Russian women, um, no, it's not going to work. Mm. You gotta, you gotta be like, you gotta be really high up there. You gotta. It's yeah, funny because it, it is it is funny white annoying white women though. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. <laughs> there is I'd be lying if I said there wasn't a part of me that doesn't get great um joy from just winding up like trad uh quote unquote trad e girl, right wing e girls on Twitter. Uh mm. it's just, it's just by being me. It's uh, it's always yeah. entertaining. Yeah, it is it, it is funny though. I mean, well, that was one of the jokes that I made, you know, right when this um current conflict that's going on in Eastern Europe uh, kicked off. The only thing I care about it is Ukraine's supply of hot big titted blondes. Yeah. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's, that's the only thing I care about. Well Trudeau wants to bring in plenty of them. Now that the men are getting drafted again. There you go. Um mm. <laughs> that's terrible. Why did I even say that? That's disgusting. They're the, you know they, free, they're calling free the Ukrainian GF. Yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe the, maybe God. there's hope for you know everybody else in the, in the spheres the frogs you know maybe they Geo, maybe you could take in a ukrainian refugee i'd have to kayfabe my my russia shilling though that's the only problem i'd because uh, you're like Geo, why do you like that nick <laughs> Geo, why are you that nick what are you putting shit i'm mm -hmm. like oh my god i i'd have to like i i I'd have to get in like an Azov bad. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Please don't clip that. No, no, no Azov as as bodies. You know, they're all uh, black metal groupies, right? They're all band groupies. The, the, the Azov women, you know, the, really? the spinny wheels. Yeah, what yeah, they, no, because. What are they, Eliza this... Blue? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> but the ones you see with the spinny wheels and the, in the, in, in like the uh, thousand dollar, like, uh, you know, cam armor, like those are all uh, basically. And around like Azov, there around the uh, Sea of Azov, and especially in Mariupol, they used to have these black metal fast festivals. And if you know anything about you know women who are uh, you know into metal groupies, you know, uh, well, it's I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say it. But, you know. <laughs>